Our game has many great themed collections. Each of them tells a story of the significant events happening in our game. The Hunt for Bismarck, collections dedicated to the release of new ships, the game's anniversary, and also to famous people. So Dasha and I would like to know, captains, which of the collections did you like most and why? Post your answers in the comments and don't forget to give this video a like and specify your in-game nickname. These simple steps will allow you not only to share your opinions about the collections you enjoyed the most, but also to become participants in a draw for a premium ship that we'll reveal at the end of the episode. So sit back and relax. It's time to set sail. It wasn't an accident that we asked you about collections. A new one appeared just recently. We're talking about the collection dedicated to Soviet battleships in the service of the motherland. Once you assemble it, you'll have the ability to change camouflage color scheme for Soviet ships and fly another flag on them. So where can you find the elements of this collection? Inside, in the service of the motherland containers, of course. Apart from that, they can hold signals, coal, expendable victory camouflages, and a combat mission. The completion will grant you one of the Soviet premium ships, including Battleship Lenin. These containers can be purchased in the armory for provision tokens, a new resource which players can earn in the friendly victory competition. If you don't have enough permission tokens, you can always find them in the premium variant of In the Service of the Motherland containers, together with even more signals and camouflages. If fortune is smiling on you, you may also receive a combat mission for one of the Soviet premium ships. Let me remind you that the premium variant of containers can be purchased both from our shop or from the armory for doubloons. Apart from various useful in-game items, you can also obtain the unique historical commander Nikolai Kuznetsov from the armory. His distinctive features are two special talents and the traditional personalization for unique commanders. And who better to stand at the helm of a Soviet battleship than Kuznetsov? What do you think? Let me know in the comments. I'd also like to remind you that the new commander is available for provision tokens. Don't forget that the 12th season of Ranked Battles is currently being held on Tier 10 ships in our game. But don't despair if you haven't researched the first 10 yet. This season, you have an opportunity to acquire any of the required ships for the duration of the event. Information about this is available on our website. The link is in the description of this video. A 457mm main battery, the engine boost consumable, and powerful secondary armament. All these and many other features found a place on Tier 9 Premium Battleship Georgia. Do you want her in your port? Then hurry and visit the armory. You'll find this American there in exchange for coal. If you don't have enough coal, but still want to take Georgia into battle as soon as possible, then pay attention to the various bundles that include this ship and our shop. We want to thank you for your comments on our previous video, where you told us all about your favorite ports in the game, which in this update have received a new look thanks to their dynamic changes between day and night. We've randomly selected one person among those who left a comment with their nickname. The winner now has Battleship Musashi. This week's prize is the reliable and incredibly beautiful Italian premium battleship Roma. So make sure to fulfill all the conditions of the draw. And don't forget to tune in for a fresh episode of Full Ahead in exactly one week's time. You might be the owner of this wonderful ship. That's it for today. As usual, we wish you great victories and moods, captains. Ну нифига себе, дублоны, кредиты, командиры с десятью очками и целую росы. Угадайте. Что? Все. Все. Все.